if you're new here, my name is Lizzie, also known as Curvy Girl Cruising, and I'm a cruise ship singer who is currently in the rehearsal process for her fourth cruise contract. I only have a couple more vlogs here in Miami, and I'm not gonna lie, this one is not gonna start off to the best one. Basically, I have been up since 2 a.m. with pressure in my ear and fluid, and it is literally pulling across the entire of my face, but today, the idea of sitting in a room with lots of live music for eight hours when I've had two hours sleep and I feel like this side of my face is extremely still is not good. I'm waiting now for information from the medical care team to where I can go and be seen. But yeah, not really the start of the week that I was planning. I don't think anyone really plans for this to be fair, but I'm very much good at like if it's a cold or if it's something like annoyance wise then i'm like okay i can deal with it just take something and go but when it's actual pain it just worries me a little bit and since i need my ear for work yeah a little bit a little bit scared i'm not even gonna lie to you if you haven't already and you wouldn't mind maybe even if you weren't and you fancy doing it out of pity right now for me um please like and subscribe i'm trying to get to 1500 by the end of the year i've never been to a American medical center. Gonna be an experience. vitals is done that all seems normal which is good so they're just gonna check my ear now we don't know what the issue is so that's good but they're really thorough and they've been so lovely this morning so fingers crossed they can help me now to pick up the prescription so it is the evening and I still feel like crap. I've been given a few bits of medication, so we're gonna roll with that a little bit. It is Taco Tuesday and it's the first Taco Tuesday I've not been to. That says a lot. I have one more chance next week, so I'm not too worried about it. I thought I was getting better and then the medication was wearing off and now I feel like crap again. I call it an early night. It's currently like 9.30 and just go to bed because last night I got two hours sleep with all this pain um, which is not very nice. The thing I was meant to be doing today at work fortunately was rock and I had done out of the five songs I was going to do today I've done four of them already so it wasn't like I missed out too much which is good. The issue is as well with it being my ear like trying to pitch when you only have one ear properly working is actually harder than you think it is. Saying that I literally bought for an emergency a Cadbury's hot chocolate sachet. And I was gonna save it for the ship, but I think today warrants having a hot chocolate. Well, good morning. It is July 4th. Yesterday, I felt like death's door. Today I've woke up, I feel good in myself. I need to still take my medication, but I'm feeling good. Instead of going out and doing anything like super big, I think today we're gonna celebrate July 4th. Everybody has the day off from work. I'm gonna just go and have a pool day. I'm obviously not gonna be drinking, so I might get myself like some fancy lemonade or something. I'm so happy that I actually am starting to feel alive, which is good. My ear is still like, not 100%. Yesterday I had off work as well and then the rest of the week is actually pretty jam-packed. Two days of work and then on the Sunday we're actually gonna go to a baseball game. So my band, Kaylee's band and Alicia, so there's like 14 of us, are gonna go and watch Miami v Chicago in the baseball. Um, I've been to baseball once before. Did I understand it? No. Will I understand it this time? No. But is it just a cool American thing to do whilst we're still here? Yes. Let's go to Target and see if we can get any 4th of July stuff for today. Say it again. Body suit. 
The bubble queen and the sparklers, princess, fucking smashed it. Kira's got a muffin. Yeah. Muffin! <laughs> Yesterday when I was on the rooftop, my ear felt okay. It's still popping, but it's not painful. Just crushed my tablets into my yogurt. And then let's go to the studios. I've just left the flat as early as possible because Jess is leaving today. She's got to finish packing up. I can't quite believe that she's going because that means I only have a week left. Absolutely mental. So excited to be back in the studios today. Just in the middle of the canteen. <laughs> so I wait for her to respond and I'll send you a joke. <laughs> I said they have, hey, they have, they hated the word. No, they're fucking not songs. <laughs> John's just looking at the camera like, hello. Studios, are we ready for a good time? Woo! Put the love in your heart. Put the love in your Oh, 
Right. That, was, that was annoying because that was a kick. Oh. Oh. <laughs> I need to do some bit of voice. Sunday and I've just woken up from a really lovely night. It was Stefan, one of the boys in the Radiance Band's birthday, so we went for a few drinks. And so Alicia having a shot. <laughs> <laughs> I did not have a shot. I am absolutely shattered though, and I'm gonna go for a shower. I'm gonna quickly get ready because we're gonna go to the baseball today. Sort out all this because my burn needs some bronzer to make it look a bit more even. So I've put on just a little outfit. Let me turn around. Actually, just shorts and a top and a hat. I was gonna wear red shorts, but it's actually Miami v Chicago. Chicago's in red, and I think we're gonna try and get a hat for Miami today. Um, but yeah, this is the look. Time to go and watch some baseball. Everybody, up! What's going on? I I know, I'm not being rude, I'm not being rude, I'm not being rude. Hell yeah! This is so cool! No, I'm really excited. Yeah. I don't know what I'm Right, let's go. Let's find us. Oh. We are allowed here at the uh, school summer camp. Can you believe? Oh, I do. Change top. We're ready. We're ready. Now, the girls like that. We do. Now, we're going to go to the team stores to try and buy a baseball hat. Yeah. And then food. Food. So we've got a frozen lemonade, we've got our hats, and we've got our jacket, it's called. Oh my god. Our hats and our jacket. Oh my god, I'm, I'm so excited. Come on, let's go. Oh, come along, come along. Yeah. Oh my god, oh my god. Let it bounce. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's gonna say. Some very suggestive corn dog there. Uh, which worries me a little bit. Oh no, that baby's not happy. Oh no. Hey there, come in. She's getting it. She's getting it. Oh yeah, the Marlin 10 go. Oh. Okay, so where are we? Is the real question. Oh. How low can you go? Oh, no. Can you go down low? All the way to the floor? So low, so low. Because I don't know the words. <laughs> <laughs> can you bring it to the top? <laughs> hey, bada bada, hey, bada bada, swing. I just got to do my thing.
Hey, also, it's the next day and I didn't finish off the vlog last night. We traveled back from Miami after the baseball and it was such an amazing day. It genuinely felt like I was in a movie. Either that or like on like a holiday. It did not feel like I was here for work at all. It was such a good time and I couldn't be more grateful for the people that came and the energy and everything, especially from the night before having a couple of drinks. Like, and I'm so happy that the Marlins won. How they won like in the last like inning was just insane but i need to get ready for work because it is actually the start of our final week and i'm going to do a full vlog so i'm going to close this one off here but thank you for watching if you like what you see please 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 like and subscribe try to get to 1500 by the end of the year and you know it might bring some luck because like my ear is still popped good energy good people good vibes maybe that will just like ping it out and i will see you in the next one